All right, here we are, national matches, first day, practice day. We have Top Shot contestant, William Bethartz. Yeah. William, thanks very much for uh, agreeing to have this interview with us. Yeah, well, it's it's, uh, it's great to be back in the game again, so uh, I appreciate being here. Yeah. So, you, you, our conversation off camera, you were talking that you shot this 10 years ago. Yeah, I, uh, I'm i just now getting back in the game after 10 years. Um, I primarily started with the Marine Corps shooting team and ended with the Marine Corps shooting teams. And uh, once I retired from the Marine Corps, you know, I kind of like to eat. So I, <laughs> I, I had to, you know, um, go and find a career again. And uh, now I'm, uh, you know, I'm working for Department of uh, Defense and, or, you know, and so uh, it's... Uh, it's just one of those things, so I'm uh, I'm real happy to be back uh, shooting again. Yeah. So now, and, and Top Shot uh, opened up a couple doors for you. And is that being being on the show? Is that what gave you the buzz again to come back out and shoot again? Yeah. Well, someone from uh, I said Department of Defense, but I meant Department of Justice uh, gave me an idea and said that uh, you know it would be nice if uh, you tried out for Top Shot, and uh, it kind of got the bug kind of going again, and. Um, so I tried out, and uh, yeah, it's it's been a good thing for me since I've uh, tied, tried out for Top Shot. And we'll give a little a shout out here. You're here, and you're shooting a Cabot gun, right? I'm here. I'm sponsored by Cabot and uh, Atlanta Arms Ammunition, and uh, myself, Brian Zenz, and uh, Everybody knows uh, Brian Sean Zenz Clavenger, mm -hmm. and um, Keith Hansel. Uh, we're all shooting for Cabot guns, and uh, the guns seem to be performing as uh, designed. And we saw you out there. You were shooting on range one practice this morning. Is that, I, I think I saw you out there on range one, right? Yes, sir. So how'd the practice go? Practice went well. Uh, it's a little whippy whippy out here, but uh, welcome to Camp Perry. <laughs> yeah. You know, it's, uh, it's holding true to form. Um, and uh, it's what most shooters come to expect. Uh, you know, we always go to Canton be before we come here. Sure. You know, it's kind of a Perry warm up. Um, to kind of, you know, prepare us to come here. But uh, unf unfortunately, at uh, Canton this year, it was 103 degrees and no wind whatsoever. <laughs> so, uh, well, that's the way it was here. When we first got here Friday, it was 102 degrees out here. And wow. We, with the stuff, we, we thought everything was going to melt. Yeah, it, it's been tr The weather's been uh, up, up and down and mostly up, uh, you know, just coming from Canton. So this is a big relief. And, you know, for most of us old shooters, uh, me, it, you know, it's all coming back to me that, you know, you can just gut these shots out in between the wind, and that's what you're going to have to do to, well, this, what, to be successful here. Uh, well, absolutely. One of the reasons we placed the shot set up right here is so you get to see that wind flag back there. So the audience, <laughs> if you look back out there, that wind flag, right. you're, you're William out there, and you put that 45 up there, and you can see that wind. And so it, can, it can definitely affect your performance. Absolutely. Most people are just happy if they can keep them on their target today. <laughs> and, uh, you know, there's times in between strings where you're, you'll find yourself on your neighbor's target. So um, it's going to be a challenging uh, match if the conditions continue. Um, but the great shooters will still rise to the top. As they say, the cream always comes That's to the right. top. And, you know, you just got to gut them out and make the best of it. Well, good. We're happy to have you here. And, and give this audience uh, some advice. Why should they come out here to shoot? Or, or, or just come out to, to watch. Why should they do that? Yeah, well, this is uh, the World Series of uh, shooting, and, uh, you know, Camp Perry is one of those places where you can come and do and see a lot of things and uh, get to be around a lot of great shooters uh, with a lot of, you know, discipline and years behind them. And, uh, you know, it's not like watching grass grow. Um, there's a lot of things going on here. Um, the team matches are phenomenal. The individual matches are phenomenal. And uh, it's one of the places where you can come and see all the service teams as well. And uh, talk to these guys and share, you know, ask questions. Have If you have ideas, you know, they're willing to listen to them. And uh, it's just one of those places where you can come and uh, really fellowship with some good shooters, world-class shooters, and uh, and learn a lot. And you get some great value. I mean, you got the, the armor vans down there. Every single armor van from uh, the military units are so helpful over there. If you have a problem or a question or anything, it's amazing the amount of knowledge that, that, that you can get Absolutely. here at Camp they're, they are so willing to help you, and uh, as a matter of fact, I often tell people if I'm not on the firing line, either before or after that, I'm over to the armor's vans, and I'm talking to these guys, and I'm having them look at my guns. I mean, they are world class at what they do. They understand exactly what where you're coming from, and um, and as far as being, you know, gunsmiths, they're the best as yeah. far as I'm concerned. Yeah, absolutely, they are. Absolutely, yeah. I, I often refer to Camp Perry as Mecca. Yes. In the shooting world, this is Mecca. It if, is the if, Mecca. If you're a pistol shooter or a rifle shooter, Camp Perry is the place that 
you need to come to. You at least have to do it once in your lifetime because uh, the experience that you would get here, just coming here one time, will change your life and change your fundamentals forever. And, I can guarantee it. And you can get to run across the contestant from Top Shot. Absolutely. You can get to run across uh, me and... Uh, you know, it, it's been great being on Top Shot. A lot of people recognize your face, your face, and uh, you know, I'm still getting used to that. You know, it's like William, and I'm like, oh, okay, where do I know you from? But uh, you know, uh, my face has been on a lot of people's TV. Well, we're happy here. that you're waving the flag. We're yeah. happy you're waving it, and we're happy to have you out here shooting. And, Absolutely. And welcome back. It's going to be good to be back, and uh, hopefully, I'll do well here. All right, man. Good luck to you. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks, Tom. Good job, buddy.